Is she seeing the animal? Yeah, she's seeing the animal. She's gonna unlock a level of her power. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who done did it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Lian from Coolest at App King Geek. Welcome to my channel. About to dive right into the season finale of Shadow and Bone, the final episode. They went into the straight line black hole <laughs> that was created by Alexandra a long time ago. He's trying to clear his name, his conscience, but he's using everybody. But he's also trying to amend so much power that they can't be messed with again. And they showed us a flashback of why he can afford to follow men anymore. You know what I'm saying? So, and Elena feels so used. Mel on his hero-ish. Kaz and his gang are on some escape-ish. I'm just ready to see this season finale-ish. <laughs> Let's just dive right into it. Like if you like my reaction, subscribe if you're not subscribed, deuces. Stefan Ali. Why are people here? They should just be the people who are gonna get rid of this problem. Having like random people just here to witness this is so weird. What are they waiting for? This is a bad gun, it's hard for you to put my load. They're building up the tension right now. How many bullets do you have? Are all these creatures those guards? Also, he wanted people to witness the power. Yo, them? They? Oh man, who cares about them? <laughs> I know that's mean, but goddamn. If they have another ADR dialogue scene. All clear. They separating? No. I'm joking, they cute. They cute. Can't hate. Just the ADR is bothering me. Are they gonna be outlaws together? I know. Mm. Oh, they in love, love. People who face tragedy and adversity together end up together in these stories. <laughs> You can change his people from the inside if he goes back. I will keep you. They're hungry. What is she looking for? What is happening? Damn. Yo, the whole squad there. Yo. Damn. She chose a side. What is he waiting for? The ninja's gonna catch Mel. They teaming up. Oh, this is where he wanted to be. What's his plan? Yo, I, this general storyline is like, what is he about to do? Damn, he's moving it forward? Damn. Damn. Mel is an idiot, man. God damn. 
What did he think was gonna happen? Oh yo. Is this season actually gonna end with this dude winning? I hope it does. Yo, everybody's acting stupid right now. Damn. Is Zoya gonna do something good now because her family was that side? Damn, she was racist the whole show. I can't support her even if she does what I think she's gonna do. You can't now be a hero. God damn. What is happening? Yo. He's putting them in the darkness? Man. What is gonna happen in this finale? Outside of whatever is happening now. Damn. Is she seeing the animal? Yeah, she's seeing the animal. She's gonna unlock a level of a power. She's becoming one with the animal. Or she's gonna remove the thing from her neck. Or she's gonna remove that thing in his arm. Damn. The stag just looked at her and she got this. Betrayed us first. You're not one of his people though. Is she just gonna breathe heavy? What has happened? Oh, what's this dude? That's we're gonna die. Oh, he's not. This is such a stupid fight. Why is it even happening? And why the hell is he using fist when he can decapitate him? I hope it's not a cliche good guys win bullshit, man. I want a complicated ending. Oh, now they're explaining it. Is he gonna take, get taken by the animal? There's no way he died like that. <sighs> I mean, like, you like to see good guys win, but for the story, he needs to be richer than black and white, man. I knew they were gonna eventually be some kind of team. I never said it, but I meant it. I thought it. What did I say? I meant it. I thought it. She's still at the that letter what what letter opener. Why are you all trusting Zoya? Man, that does not make sense. The Zoya part. You just added a family in there to make it make sense, but it's still not sitting well with me. Oh, so they not a squad. They just cordial. Come back from where? Where are they gonna train? Why are they hugging? This does not make sense. So they are aware that Grishas are gonna get hunted, but they're like, ah, we can deal with that later. This story is so weird at the end. <laughs> is this how the book goes? <laughs> Maybe I'm just mad because my favorite character is gone. What is happening? He doesn't trust you anymore. God damn. She left her people for somebody who doesn't trust her. All of these storylines are just unnecessary conflicts, unnecessary resolutions. Yo, now she's with them. More conflict built. I don't care. She on the same boat? I'm not sure how I feel about this for now, yo. I know he ain't dead. He's got scars now. On some Punisher ish. Damn, is it gonna follow him? Yo, the creatures are following him. Oh shit. That was the only dope part of this finale. Everything else did not make sense. <laughs> I'm sorry. You can find me in the comment section, but this finale, people are acting out of character so much.
except our cast Jasper and the ninja lady. Those are the only three people that acted normal. Everybody else was just weird. <laughs> So was um, Alexandra's redemption, him uh, making sure that the Grishas never get hurt again? Was that his redemption, not actually building this thing? Because he kept on talking about redemption, redemption, then a flip over time. He's like, no, I want complete domination. Like... So much in this, but I, I'm trying to figure out why they think Zoya racist. Like she had this line saying, I still don't like you, but we need you. You did not only not like her, you are, you're so horrible to everybody. <laughs> you're so horrible to everybody to now have a moral compass in a family that was birthed this episode. So weird, man. And the, the thought process of them going into hiding to later save everybody when the threat is now. People think she's dead now. People think her it's her fault now. I know she doesn't have the power to do anything about it right now, but Showing them okay with the fact that they basically leaving the Grishas to suffer. So many weird decisions. Man, they better have a season two and they better find a way to justify everything I just saw. <laughs> Yo, like it's still a good season though, but so much decision making did not make logical sense to me in this episode please explain to me if you know why all of that should make sense to me yeah and you're making it seem like a happy ending with like a threat at the end nothing ended happy there's so many conflicts that arose maybe to keep us interested for a second season but i was already interested they didn't may have to make it seem happy and die at the same time man i don't know how to feel about this finale the show in total i'll probably give it like a 7.5 it's decent it's decent it's not mind bending but decent I'm not sold on this franchise yet. <laughs> like I'm legit, I legit want to see more because it did not make sense to me. Not because I'm hype. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, tell me what you guys think. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Deuces.